travelers. Welcome to the Four Millennium. We're about to arrive to destination, so please, fasten your seatbelts and be prepared for landing. You're about to witness the wonders that humanity has reached throughout the last thousand years. But before that, let's take a moment and return to the year 2022. Let me start with a question. Have you ever imagined what the future will be like? Fantasize about amazing spaceships, interdimensional travel, and basically a futuristic utopia? Because personally, I have, I'm not sure most, or maybe all of you, have been curious about what's next, and that's completely normal. You know, when I was younger, and still to this day, I've been a huge Star Wars fan. Seeing those incredible hyperspeed travels and those amazing adventures led me to want to take my own spaceship and explore the galaxy. Then, all these feelings led me to wonder, what if our future could take a path in that way? And I'm going to be honest, I'm not talking about like saviors or magic at night. I'm talking about the technology, new planets, new species, and maybe even new adventures. So you may be asking, why do I tell you all of this? Because I have a proposal, a project proposal. So what if people from all around the world could write, define, or just express what they imagine how the future will be like? People can let their imagination run wild and just wonder about their perfect utopia then all of these ideas and expectations could be stored to later discover a thousand years from now. Do you like a time capsule? <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I don't know how we can store this information, but maybe we can just send a spaceship that flows around in space, waiting to be found. Okay, so this project will only hypothetically help future researchers discover how their past or our present was like but it also has a potential making a difference in a current society. You see, hopes and dreams can actually become goals. And this comes from the words of the American businessman, Harvey McKay. Dreams take many forms. Sometimes, in our minds, we can go places that help us formulate plans and goals that will help us shape our future. So, when people cry, or just stop to think, about what they hope will be a reality, the desire of it even becoming true can make them realize what's needed to be done for the dream to come to life. Dreams like a cure for cancer, equality for everyone, no more wars, no more violent deaths, or just world peace can seem impossible to think about, right? But remember, we're talking about a thousand year period. You think about how crazy it is. I think that in the last millennium, a whole continent was discovered. Humanity walked in the moon. Solutions for many illness were found. Also, political, agricultural, and re technological revolutions happened. And not long ago, our eyes were open to the universe, thanks to the telescope James Webb. And I have many more examples, but my intention is to keep you here all day. So you see, most or maybe all my previous mentions will seem out of a fairy tale for humanity a thousand years ago, right? But all those dreams can come true, but we can't just wait for a genie and magically grant our wishes. We need to work and fight for it. And even so, we won't see that future. One long year, you're some kind of vampire. Our great, 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 and great many more grandchildren will. So. What kind of future do we want them to be a part of? Because our current rate or own planet Earth won't last long. And I don't want to sound apocalyptic, but with our home, humanity won't last either. Change needs to be done now. If we just want a small time capsule, we can make people realize what needs to be done for all the dreams that come to life. So please, all of you, close your eyes for a moment. Close your eyes, thank you and think about what changes you want to see. Think about what you hope will be a reality. Just let your imagination fly. 
And now, open your eyes and see that we have arrived here 2022. Thank you.